So yeah. what I'm saying is, U- UK should never ever have Stan culture. Why? Because if don't you want to be a, a little hustler? So if everyone, <laughs> so if everyone becomes, uh-huh. if, everyone becomes <laughs> if everyone becomes um, tenants, because gigs are the landlord, yeah. tenants, yeah. yeah where my tenants then, at right now? This then, actually sounds really and good. And then whenever my tenants in the middle, yeah. Yeah. oh yeah. left always been good advance we have putty to my right the music master himself dj matthews and of course finally the spiciest thing on the internet guys it's quite hey your zips undone yeah no, wait hold on give me a second <laughs> why i'm why? trying to help you no it's a bus oh okay yeah two weeks in a row you, bro. do you know what i mean steady on soldier <laughs> Oh, um, shout out and much love to Rebecca for holding it down while I was away. Thank you, baby girl. <laughs> and shout out to you guys as well for doing your regular job. Thank you. <laughs> like, cool. Well, Ooh. talking about being away from home, 21 Savage. No? <laughs> <laughs> I guess that, that kind of works. It that works. works. That it works. works. That works. This one, they don't respect <laughs> me. Yeah. Thank you. You lot are disgusting. Wait, that no, works. no, wait. Bunch of Patrice wait, Everest. Oh, fuck, the law no. of you. Oh, yeah. They're not making light of the fact that it's a very serious incident. I was just trying to move forward. I'm not trying to be funny, but I doubt he's going to come get you. Like, he's in America. No, now. no, but it's a no, very serious thing. Saying about obviously. The We've all had relatives that, like, you know. She's doing wait, a quiet disclaimer. Wait, we've all had relatives that what? That what? That, that what? That, what? That, that, what? that don't have papers. That have friends that may have issues similar nah, to this. Nah, B. No. Can't relate. <laughs> what are you on about? <laughs> I'm just trying to connect. So you're saying we all immigrants? So we've got relatives no, we that all, I said we all immigrants. have relatives mm-hmm. that may, ha- may mm. have friends that have experience in this. That's I a very have relatives that mm. may. You know what I mean? I'm kind of far That's what I'm saying. Yeah. We may have friends that have killed what you're someone. Saying. Whoa, what? You yeah. are moving Yes, mad. Uh, let's move. Anyway, <laughs> 21 Savage from the end. That's the, that's yeah. the takeaway. From but For me, it wasn't that shocking because I saw someone say it ages ago. There's been tweets about it like, bubbling under, but it's actually real. Like, I find the reaction weird. Why? I find it so weird that it was so interesting. But that is interesting. I don't think so. Why not? Because all it is is that he's from England. But he's American and everyone thought he was American. I don't know. It's just not that shocking to me. What? Like, I, I don't know. Like, as I in, find like, that super I think that's like, amazing, the fact yeah. that it became such a huge topic, like, I was so surprised. I didn't realise that it would be such a big topic. Of course it's a what huge topic. What are you topic. talking about? I'm sorry, I just didn't. I feel <laughs> like, sorry, especially I didn't. because I feel like in the music industry, UK hasn't, up, up until recently, the UK hasn't really had its respect or its clout, I don't know. So to have someone who's really successful and then surprise, they're actually from the UK. Well, he's still American. No, he let, is. Let, let's not get he twisted. He is, but it still, still plays into the narrative that like, it was know, just a, the UK It was almost split. a joke for us to claim him. We can't claim 100%. him. Like 21 Savage is what an American rapper looks like. Yeah. As in like dreads, yeah, tattoo tattoos. on his face. Like yeah, the way he speaks, yeah. the way he raps is like the current climate of rap in America. Of course, it's interesting that he's originally yeah, from from here. So, what is the situation? He's gonna have to fight that out for like a couple for a while, and then he's in twenty three hour lockdown, isn't he? Yeah, one hour. He's not a criminal. Yeah. Well, actually, according to their law, right? I don't know. Well, he broke his yeah, visa, his visa, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, his mum's flipping pen though. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Is she not? Absolutely beautiful lady, honestly. Genuinely. <laughs> like, she is really attractive. Yeah. So is that your whole takeaway from the whole thing? Okay, my, okay, let me give a better takeaway. My takeaway from it is this. A year ago, I think it was about, I said on Twitter that I see UK rap as a different genre to... Um, rap in America and everyone said that they're the same genre um, that it's a, a bit of a variation but they're the same genre I don't think they say it's a variation they just say it's the same genre that rap is rap so everyone must maintain the same energy and either categorise 
21 as a UK rapper since so he's in the UK now or they're just going to have to accept that they're two different genres like I said this whole time but he he's just a comes rapper. up with like <laughs> that's my hot take what are you talking about that's my hot stuff. take UK rap's a separate genre and I like to and I just feel like this. Why I feel like it reads from that. 21 Savage to that because that's the only thing I took from it and even someone the tweeted, tweeted someone tweeted someone said someone said that if he's from the UK it now makes him the most successful rapper um the most successful UK rapper ever. And then for me, it just reiterated the fact that we need to separate UK rap and US rap because it's completely different things. Okay, I feel like that sounds like a fair point now you've explained yeah. it. <laughs> They're completely separate things. I don't know how he's got to yeah, just I, find no a way. <laughs> Every week he finds a way to prove that something he said 10 years ago was right. Because like I don't, like I don't, I don't, because I don't make, I don't, I don't have <laughs> debates on here and like not take it away with me. Now I'm thinking about that shit a year later, a month later. I'm trying to see how shit fits but into it. But you will it. find anything to Yeah, of course. It. 100%. Like anything. I enjoy being right. <laughs> <laughs> like, excuse me for like being right. So did you guys see in the news this week, um, not even the news, the announcements, I guess you could call it, um, Little Mix basically screamed at Miss Banks saying that they want her to come out with them on the stage at the Brit Awards. I'm assuming that's like a pre-planned... Um, yeah. Like label thing, do you know what I mean? Like but yeah, oh they've really? said oh. what, do you think Lil Mix just sit at home and just plan their you know Let's what? Tweet Miss Banks. Yeah, like come on of course it's pre planned label. Suckers shit. like you to believe. It, yeah, literally, like, literally <laughs> that must literally. be aimed at people that think no one puts that much thought. Okay. Do you I not accept remember it? That I accept it. Lil Mix on a tune, Nicki Minaj and Cardi B said they offered it to me first. Yeah. That was Lil Mix, isn't it? Yeah. And Cardi B was like, Yeah, they offered me the tune first and then I was like, nah, and I gave and you could have it. And then Little Mix yeah. were like, no, nah, actually, we always had Nikki in mind. Yeah, We're team I, I remember that, but... Yeah, like, my point is, all, everything's orchestrated, obviously, so... Well, that's really disappointing. Really? Not always. It can't always be. For the Maybe part, with, I mean, like, in... Of the time. Yeah. Okay, do you mean, like, with the, um... That's how collaborations work. That's how collaborations yeah, yeah. work. Okay, 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 okay. Fair enough. Yeah, that's how it all works and stuff like that. But anyway, um, they did that, and then, as soon as that happened, Little Mixes, um... Uh, what are their fans called? Mixers? I don't mixies. know. Mixies. Oh whatever right. whatever you would call them. Sure they're not called mixies. The fuck I don't drugs. Know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> well <laughs> the little mixes fan base. Fuck anyway, em. immediately went to search up uh, Miss Banks lyrics and um they one, they took a lyric that was incorrectly quoted, um, where something like something like stop acting like you're about it. She was saying stop acting like you're about it. But the way she said it is like, stop acting like you're bi. I don't know how to say it, how she said it. But basically, the lyric was written down as, stop acting like you're bi, little bitch park off or some shit like that. And they were like, oh, explain this immediately. And I'm saying this is like five seconds after the little mix even announced it. Then obviously she explained that it was a typo. And then they were like, okay, cool. And then they pulled up, um, I guess, a tweet from her past. Um, And, you know, they tried to cancel her, but... She no. fought it back quickly. That shit's so cool. How did man. she fight it back? She apologised. She apologised. Oh, did she? But yeah. it wasn't, it didn't actually say by it. No, no, no. no the the, they brought a tweet. The tweet oh. said what she said. She was what laughing, she laughing at, at something. Something someone said, like a, a homophobic joke. Yeah. She put LOL. And you then, know on the old Twitter where you couldn't retweet? You yeah. had to put a star or some sort of sign and then add your comment after. You see me, yeah? When I was, um, when I... I was sending m- emails and messages to like people I haven't spoken to in like five years. Like, oh, there's a tweet you quote tweeted of me. <laughs> right, hello, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to get rid of that one, mate. Um, yeah, it's a bit peak. But the game's the game. As soon as you start doing well, obviously people are gonna. But you see how quickly um, she was man- she managed to like quiet that down because a year or two years ago that would be enough outrage for like there to be serious you know consequences. What? I don't think this pulling up old it tweets was one, is, it was has the same tweet. energy anymore. It was one tweet, so I think that's why she was cool. I think it was, I think it's funny how after she apologised, there's little cunts in her mentions like, "Oh, okay, well now that you explained, we understand." <laughs> like, Who the fuck it's are cool you? Now. Yeah, that's what they want though. It's the a better satisfaction. You? Oh, now that you've explained, oh, it's okay, we're gonna allow it. Like, Wait, what, you, you call gonna... some cunts? I call them fucktards, and everyone starts. Having yeah, because I'm talking. Because you, you yeah, called the whole, you called the whole, the, the whole. Are you having a fucking look? You could the, called Where the whole fan base fucktards. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just talking about the ones fucking that were trips. literally say, "Oh, thanks for your apology. Now we understand. Like, you can, you know, you can go about. You can, you, like, what? A lot of them are the most. A lot of them. Fuck off. Like, who are you? 
Them mixies are gonna be on you. Like, Watch. Who oh, are pull you? up my old tweets. You fucking melt. Who are you? Like, remove you all of them. You twats. Ah, right. You're so silly. Right. They're going this week. Both. Like, can you imagine? Yeah. Oh, it's okay. You can. You could. Like, fuck off, man. So yeah. What I'm saying is, U- UK should never ever have stand culture. Why? Because if don't you want to be a, a little hustler? So if everyone, <laughs> so if everyone becomes, uh-huh. if, everyone becomes <laughs> if everyone becomes, if everyone becomes tenants, because gigs are the landlord, yeah. tenants, yeah. Where my tenants then, at right now? Then, this actually sounds really and good. Then whenever, the tenants in the yeah, 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 yeah. No, but there's a difference though. There's a difference though. Like with the tenants. <laughs> You take the fucking train to Stratford Westfield. Ten tenants are catching you slipping. <laughs> this ain't like in America. This beehive bumblebees, they could be in the yeah, other side of the yeah, country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you We're sure lost, you Wola. want stands in London? <laughs> stands will be different. Stands, Where are tenants at? Fuck, it's London. Stands will just be gangs. Yeah. <laughs> just That's be gangs. what it is now. Eh? Literally, That's what it is gangs. now. And then imagine, one of, one member of the gang becomes a rapper. Bro, imagine, That's it. imagine someone, imagine That's like Hall of Spartan stands. It's fucking peak. Sparta. Like Spartans, oh, like, it's fucking peak. Like, no, nah, stand culture should not come to the UK. People will get hurt. Yeah. Uh, Pause for a second. Yeah. So this weekend, um, early hours of Saturday, I believe, we were met with sad news about the passing of, of Cadet. Obviously, um, through the car accident. And, you know, it's been, it's been tough, I think. Apart from storming maybe Esco, Cadet's someone that's popping now. So it's sort of, it's sort of, it's, it's put everyone in a different sort of space. So um, I think Krept is hurting a lot at the moment. Obviously his family's hurting at the moment, but um, <coughs> I think we should take this time to, you know, celebrate Cadet. Mm. You know, any personal experiences anyone has had with him, anything we remember, I can personally remember having conversations with Heil um, our, our producer, um, and he used to tell me, because I'm from East and I was from South, he used to say all the time, bruv, Cadet's a legend. And I didn't know who Cadet was. I honestly didn't know who Cadet was until the slut freestyle. And when I watched that, I was like, wow, like, Brilliant. this guy is mad. Like, and Cadet's always been that person that kept it real. And that's going to be a big hole that we've lost. Like, he's the guy that said, bruv, I don't check my nan. My account's in minus. Yeah. I'm a young black boy that raps like every black boy in the country. Like, and imagine if he didn't use that tool, his voice, to reach out to Krept about the issue with his girlfriend cheating on him yeah. and he thought Krept knew. Like, that situation got resolved through the music. Like, that just shows that that was his, that was his tool, that was his voice. Like, yeah. first time I met him was at Word on the Curb as well. <coughs> It was like he it was all love it was all good vibes he came to the back chat reunion when nobody else wanted to come and last week coincidentally i happened to be with him at a club performance as well and it was just like i was like bro like congratulations on advice and he was like fam <laughs> he literally said it's about time fam it's about time and the performance like he killed it he he was even saying to the promoter bro you gotta book me book me here again like and it's just like I don't know, man. Even after they were br- they were bringing so many bottles, that literally um, his manager is one of my friend's uncle. So um, they were bringing in so many bottles that his his uncle, his manager was like to us, "Oh, you lot can take bottles home." So they're taking bottles, and me and my boy, we've taken a couple bottles. So we're walking off. Then obviously cadets leaving. So. I walk back to say bye because I'm not just gonna walk out with a man's bottles in it. So I walk back to say bye, and I'm like, oh, like you shut it down, safe. And he's like, love, bro. Right, right, right. Then we're walking off. Then he goes, hold on, are those my bottles? Bro, run, run them here. <laughs> he goes, oh, run them here, run them here. But we just gave it to him because we were like, oh, it's obviously he's managed. <laughs> 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 Bruv, I'm shameless, isn't it? But the thing is, I didn't collect the bottles on that. Oh, we're gonna sneak bottles from his table. <laughs> his manager was like to us, "Oh, you lot take bottles home, isn't it?" So obviously <laughs> it was miscommunicated. But literally, they gave him a bottle of honey in his rider, and that was in my pocket. So I didn't give that to him. So I've still literally got that bottle of honey there. So like, bro, I'm just gonna hold on to that, man. That's gonna that's gonna be like that's a memory. So Fuddy, what was your favourite cadet song ever? 
because I feel like I can predict what your favorite song was. Okay. Yeah, I'm just saying. Uh, predictable. Um, I don't know. Alright, cool. So with Cadet musically, as a fan of his music, obviously I'd been seeing his stuff from years ago, like maybe I'd say it's back in like 2010, 2011 times, or whatever. Um, I would say for a long time, I always said that I think he's a sick storyteller and blah blah blah, and I was calling for him to collaborate with Ratman from years ago, cause like. I used to listen to Ratman mixtapes and stuff like that when, yeah, people weren't really listening to Ratman mixtapes. Um, so I always used to say, like, there's like bare tweets of me saying, like, Cadet and Ratman need to do a thing together. Cadet and Ratman need to do a thing together. So for me personally, my favourite Cadet is Cadet on Shower's Story 3, personally. Mm. Especially when he's telling Shower that he's going to put his mum under the dirt. That was freaking fantastic. And it was so believable as well. And the back to back with RA as well. Like, yeah, fantastic. That's my favourite cadet on Shower uh, Story. That wasn't predictable at all, actually. And so. when he's calling him on the phone and he's telling him... When he's talking to his sister, oh my God, you know how fucking funny that is? My niece! <laughs> my niece! <laughs> <laughs> he's a shabble, shabble. He's pure passion, bro. bro yeah, He was so well. angry. For <laughs> well, pure passion. I think he was the only one in character probably the whole yeah, time. Yeah, that's what I'm like. saying. Like, you don't have to listen to... What did you think I was going to say? I, I, know, I thought it was going to be like slut or closure for me. I, I feel like those were that. I think both of those were one of the first um, things I listened to from Cadet actually, and um, I just even just everything I've listened to from him. He's always coming from a very unique perspective. Like obviously as a female, I don't really know fully what boys go through, especially in like the teenage years. And he's so good at articulating it and just kind of I don't know, just giving a completely different insight. And I think he talks. He says, "I love you." in songs like to, to other men, he like, he will talk about just like, I mean, topics like abortion, talk about things from a perspective I, I could never understand in terms of I'm not a male. Um, and I just think he just does it so well. And I, I think he's contribute, like I've never met him obviously, but I think his contribution to the scene was just his, like his perspective and his ability to articulate that. I think it, it really is something very special. And um, I think I saw li like interviews where people put little clips out. I saw little interviews of what he wanted to leave behind, like a legacy, he wanted people to be inspired by him. And I, I definitely think that that's been achieved. Um, yeah, cause he's, I, I don't think there's anyone else in the scene that's done that. And so if somebody else does do that, we would know that he kind of speared that, like, he, like spearheaded that. So yeah, I think it's incredible. Um, but yeah. My, mine's gotta be the slot free star, 100%. I like, just don't like the platform that gave guys to say that girls are not. Bro, man like said I've got girls in sections wanting DP. <sighs> man said I've got a mixed race thing and a ginger that I knocked down. Like he, the reaction when the camera kept yeah, pulling and focusing no, to the, the two girl, girls yeah. at the back. <laughs> and he, he wasn't even paying them no mind. Man yeah. was just like I going swear ham. He sweats when he raps. He's I passion. Cadet is insane. passion. Like pure passion. Insane. Like all the way through. Like. <laughs> insane. Yeah, before retweet or delete, I owe someone an apology. Hmm. I'm nervous. <laughs> Rams. Okay. I owe Rams an Fair. apology because <laughs> Hold You Down, the song and the video is amazing. Look, like, hold, hold You Down's a banger. He's pulled it out of the bag and I, I did not see it coming from anywhere, so. The video is strong. I think I have to listen to the songs a couple times. The you song guys is sick. are really saying it's amazing. No, the I song is it was, sick. It was all right. And it's not even like, it's sick for Rams. The song is actually sick. <laughs> like, no, because if you, <laughs> no, let's be honest. If you release like a, an average song, people gas it up and be like, oh, because it's Rams, this is decent. So they'll say it's good. But this song is actually good. Like. I can imagine anyone that's in that upper tier releasing that and it, it will be of standard. So mm. I said that he's not one to watch for 2019 and <laughs> I, <laughs> I apologise for that, Rams. So yeah. I've got on to you, so I'm keeping the same energy and I'm apologising and saying well done. Because hmm. I'm a real nigga. You have to wish you were here. Wish you were here. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, V2 or delete, shit, sorry. Wait guys, we didn't even nah, do like fuck a... That. Sometimes you got back because you, you just got to back it out. Okay. <laughs> However, I do have some things I want to mention. Oh yeah, be mention. careful. Okay, be I don't careful. need to be careful. Be careful. I really don't need to be careful. Be careful. Okay, so 
we obviously see he's gone back and like he's gone back in time with the sounds very 08 in my opinion which i can appreciate however is that Dr. Zeus type of rapping? That's not Dr. Zeus. It this is. It's not. It's so not that's, not not that's not disrespectful. That's not disrespectful. That's, that's not. not he's, disrespectful. He's spanked, he's spanked Wiley in the way that Listen, he deserves and that's needs what I'm to saying. be spanked. Hold on, hold on. Let her land. Okay, so Let yeah. her land. Like, it's that, it's that old school, like, very, like, easy to pick up sound, right? And I think I can appreciate it because he's going back at Wiley. This is an ongoing beef. It makes, you mm -hmm. know, it, it's smart to, like, use a sound that they both you know, both came up over. So I can give him a retweet for that. If it was a song, standalone, and it wasn't, it didn't have the background of like, going back at Wiley, I wouldn't really be checking for it that much. And that's that my honest opinion. This is Skepta, like, yeah, like this, everything uh, about this whole song is Skepta. Like, really last really year, did I not just hold say on, that? Lay, relax, I'll let you speak. <laughs> last year, I was screaming, saying I want Skepta back. And now Skept this is Skepta. This is shut down Skepta. This Thank is that's, that's not me Skepta. Okay. That's the hook of that's not me is the same as this. That's Repeating exactly the same line. Say. That is Skepta. Wonderful. So I already you're have saying, a song that does that. I don't need an another But that's one. Skepta. You're asking him, what do you want him to do? You wait, 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 wait. You've you you all you've done, all you've done, all you've done, all you've done, all you've done here is explain why you've retweeted him. And that is fair. You can't come and say that that has to be the same reason why I, I've retweeted him like exactly, literally, almost exactly for the same reason. I understand the, I understand why he's taking this stance, and I think it's a good song. However, but he, what stance? Like uh, why he's decided to use that sound and why he's decided to use his that normal beat. sound. His sound though. His normal, a normal skepta beat, a normal I'm skepta saying, flow. I'm saying if it wasn't for the context, I wouldn't be checking for this song. This yeah. sounds no different to that's not me. Shut down skepta, which is a more recent and version pure of water. skepta. I pure don't know, water. I, yeah, pure world, which I also wasn't really checking for either. But I think this one's cold. Yeah, and cold. you're entitled to. And it's guess cold. what? I'm not gonna do. Jump on you for that. What about you? You also like it? Yeah, it's hard. In it, saucy. It's hard. It's hard. Yeah, it's good. Exactly so what I would want from Skepta. Perfect. This and Wiley. Did you hear Skepta shout me out saying I was there no. on the tune? No. Oh, this guy's about to chat shit. Yeah. Two minutes twelve. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Chat to me! I was there, cuz! I was there, cuz! You know I was there, cuz! There was literally five you know, I thought, I thought, on this I thought road. Skeptor was gonna say that you was there. Okay, prove to me. I was gonna say that you Prove to me that I wasn't there. Prove to me that I wasn't there. I actually thought we gonna say that you were there. Prove to me I wasn't there. Were you there? Yes, I was. No, you weren't there. I was there. You weren't there. I was there. You weren't there. But Tegra Day is the same old. Is it a retweet or a delete, guys? Let's go. I thought I had the wrong one up. Retweet. All right, cool. You're going to have to explain this one. All right, so the vocals at the start were terrible. Like, whatever he was doing at the beginning was really not great. However, when we actually got into the flat, to the bars, I don't know what it was, but I really liked the whole, the overall sound. Like, I actually did enjoy the overall sound. So for me, it's actually a retweet. But um, like, if you listen to it, skip like 20 seconds. Um, right, well, <laughs> for me personally, generally, if I have to skip, would you say 20 seconds? 20 seconds. Of your of a two and a half minute minute song. Yeah, listen, that's not really a good sign. Remember this, guys, because I'm going to have to use this against sign. Cody in the future. Um, okay. And like, you can have bad parts of your song, but not at the beginning, because that will make me turn I think it what off. I yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So for me, I, I, was, I wasn't feeling the start at all. Um, what he was doing there, it sounded poorly produced and poorly mixed as well. And um, he said a line along the lines of, people are full of shit, anal? Anal, yeah. Yeah, that was the last straw for me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Teg Grenade, genuinely, but... Wow. He's like, all, that he's, was he's really He's always not. showing us love but, as well. Yeah, but, but like, this is the thing, though. Like, why would... You, ah, you know what, yeah, because you said I, I'm not even going to... He's always showing us love, but uh, for me... I just wasn't I, feeling I'm sorry. I wasn't a fan of that, the flow. I hate that flow. But this is my thing. How are you gonna make a song about everyone doing the same old flow, and, you're and then you do a flow that we've been that we've heard before? That flow, that's flow my flow issue. Go, 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 that's it's literally a no, my. No. That's my <laughs> issue. Like if, and I don't want to be rude because you said he shows love, but. You can't make a song called Same Old talking about people using the same old but flow. But you guys right? are and literally the same just, old flow. you guys just Quite, literally Did you hear what I said? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold you on. Guys just, it's, hold on, I, hold on. If I misunderstood, fine. Hold on. You guys, are, you guys literally just retweeted Skepta for doing 
the same thing that he's been hold doing. On, hold because, on, Because it's Skepta oh. doing it. All right, go ahead. What's Do Skepta's today? song? What? <laughs> oh, what? What's Skepta's song called? Wish you would stop doing the same one. <laughs> no, that's it. No, like, no, no. Oh, you yeah, know that's it. Do you know what? Do you know what? It's because it's and, Skepta. No, no, no. Well, it's because it's Skepta. No, it's because it's Skepta. Skepta. You, you should have just, do you know what you should have just said? Was, let me, let me redo on, this whole segment. On. Retweet because it's Skepta. You like, retweeted it already. No, no, that's what you guys, you don't even need to say all well, the stuff you We're making points and you're just like, hold, okay, Skepta, okay, Skepta went on his, Skepta has been being Skepta. This guy is being yeah. like everybody else, saying, don't be like everybody else. Uh, that so doesn't make sense. The chorus is everyone's doing the same old. Every rapper's got the same flow, did he say? But then his flow sounds a lot like all the flows and I've heard. When everyone, wait, when everyone was rapping on yeah. Rick Ross beats and American tunes, who was the one person that said, we need to cut that shit out? He was keeping his ears to the streets. The UK went right out of ideas. Everybody, everybody doing covered of American beats. Are if you ain't the Ace Hustle Hard Flow, then it all sounds so like so worse to me. Thank if you it's so the shit I'm supposed to respect, then SMD. P A U S to the E. I don't care who you're pretending to be. I don't care what gun you bash. I don't care what drug you sell. Fuck you, man. I will smack both of you. What do you mean? Because I've got a manager, a DJ, seven mm -hmm. MCs, and five oh, producers on my label. Okay. So okay. before you start eating. Is there anything in the game? He might be. It might too many clever. That's what I said. That's why I retweeted it. I literally, oh, I literally retweeted it. That could potentially be the thing, but I'm not I said that. it's very smart. I, I literally said no, no, no. that. I get you, but at the same time, too many men do come in the game for two minutes. Spit two videos, two two lyrics. All of a sudden, they can't imagine the same sentence by me being crazy. What is this one coming to? Get invented in the same sentence. That's good. What is this one coming to? Man, they are coming to the same sentence. That's good. 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 That's support you right. start standing Stand up, up on you. screaming bbk bbk <laughs> bbk okay let's stop now though but yeah it's a delete still but <laughs> <laughs>